time for the annual Christmas cold start. Ah, yep. This year we're sitting at 244,000 and change. Really more like, probably more like 250 at this point. 248, 250. Let's see what we get. Merry Christmas 2019 um, if you're new to the channel thank you thank you for subscribing thank you to subscribers new and old um, sorry this year has been a little bit funky in terms of getting content out and um, mostly due to to my own kind of I guess laziness um, been a lot of times where I've taken videos or taken clips and started putting them together and I didn't like them and I didn't feel like going back to, to redo the shot and it just kind of fell apart like that. <clears throat> um, however, um, I am going to be putting significantly more effort into the Duramax swap videos uh, because I think that for the first time in a while I've had um, some genuinely interesting content to watch and um, and I think the Duramax swap is of a magnitude that it deserves a good amount of effort to be um, invested into it <clears throat> so you'll see you know substantially more editing uh, more post-production type stuff um, I'll be using my computer more to edit as opposed to my phone so keep an eye out for that um, if there's anything in particular that anyone wants to see whether related to the Duramax or not or just anything please please comment and uh, you know <clears throat> you never know when inspiration can strike and sometimes it can strike in the form of somebody asking you to make a video about something that you wouldn't have thought was otherwise interesting so don't hesitate to ask as far as that's concerned um, 2019 overall was a pretty good year I think um, you know we had some setbacks with the truck obviously the transmission which is now <clears throat> um, again not happy it runs way too cold um, pro tip six five guys don't get rid of the cooler in your or the heat exchanger rather in your radiator do not do it because without it training temps will be hot when it's hot and it will be cold when it's cold as opposed to any sort of regulated kind of equilibrium. Um, I got rid of mine because my radiator's fucked and I didn't feel like putting a radiator in it because I know I'm gonna have to put a new one in for the Duramax anyway and it wouldn't have been compatible and just I didn't feel like going through all that bullshit. But it was a good year for the truck overall. <clears throat> um, had a couple couple passes at uh, Lebanon Valley Dragway in New York. We got a hook at Hebron um, for the Hebron Fair this fall. Um, put about, I think I calculated, it was something like, did like 12,000 miles on the truck this year, which for being not my daily, is pretty good. And, um, you know, it's just, it was a uh, overall a pretty good year plow day was great we're only a couple months away from plow day 2020 um and uh you know it's just a good year all around so thanks to everyone who continues to watch and have a very merry christmas